Hello, this is Brian Meredith with C2G Engineering. I'm here at Bluefield Sanitary Westside Center Plant. We're down here today doing a non potable water system with three pumps. We're going to show you how easy it is to set up a multi pump control, intelligent pump control with the new ABB ACQ 580 drive. So, first, we're going to do is we're going to come into menu, we're going to go into primary settings, we're going to go down and select multi pump control. We're going to select pump mode and we're going to select intelligent pump control. And we're going to set the node to one because we have three pumps and we need to have a different node number for each pump. Now we're going to go into settings for this pump. Now we're going to leave the default name to pump one. The node number is already set to one. We're gonna select this that can be a master or a slave. Preferred pump is set to medium so we can set the priority of each pump. And once we finish that, we're gonna go down to the intelligent pump control share settings. We're gonna synchronize all of our settings to be shared between all three drives. So now it's copied all the parameters. Now we're gonna go down the total number of pumps since we have three pumps on this application, we're gonna set that to three, save that. We're gonna come down, always run at least, we wanna at least run one pump on this application at all times. So we're gonna make sure that we're set to number one pump. Now, never to run more than one pump on this application because they never need more than one pump. So we've saved that to pump one. Start, stop, speed setting, we're going there. And if they had a second pump running that was allowed, we can actually set it to come on at 48 hertz and stop at 25 hertz to give you a little bit of extra pressure on this system. The transition smoothening, we're going to set that to four seconds, and that gives you the transition between pump one to pump two or pump two to pump three. Now we just finished setting up the intelligent pump control, and now we're going to back all the way out to the main screen. And now we're going to give it a run command. And as you can see, pump two is now starting to ramp up to build the pressure up on the system. We're going to let that ramp up to speed. Now that pump two is up to speed and it's built the pressure up on the system, we're going to shut it off and show you how pump one will automatically come on and start a smooth transition, ramp it back up to maintain the pressure on the system. As you can see, pump two shut down and pump one is now ramping up to build the pressure back up on the system. Now we've got our pressure back up to 70 PSI, which is what they're trying to maintain on the system. And now we're gonna shut this off. And you see the pump is now, the drive is ramping the pump down to zero hertz. And this is how easy it is to set up the new ABB ACQ 580 drive. ABB. I'd like to thank Bluefield Sanitary at the Westside Plant for letting us come in and demonstrate how easy it is to set up the multi-button function.